We're studying our own students, trying to figure out what were the attributes of a student most likely to thrive at Hampshire College. So we went to faculty and asked for recommendations of the best third and fourth year students at the college. We interviewed the students and then we looked at their admission files, which were three or four years old at that point. There was no correlation between ISAT or ACT scores and being a thriving student. We really get to focus on what Hampshire set out to do from the very beginning, which was offer an incredibly experimental and innovative educational experience, one that we think is the best liberal arts model in the country. Once we made the decision to get rid of the SAT and the ACT, US News and World Report dropped us from their rankings. And that was incredibly liberating, especially to me as an admission person, because there was absolutely no incentive for us to do the things that other colleges feel they have to do. Growing application numbers so that they can deny more students and chase high SAT scores so that they can raise their average SAT score in order to raise their ranking. And maybe give financial aid to students who don't need it because they have high test scores in order to get them to come to your school. We're really trying to see the person as a whole and understand what they would be like. We started to look for really specific attributes in students knowing that these are the things that do correlate with success at Hampshire. The primary thing that we're looking at is actually the high school transcript, but we're not looking for a specific GPA. We're looking for a high degree of motivation. We're looking for evidence of empathy. To what extent do they really care about the world around them and the communities that they're a part of? And will they be a positive contribution to our community? We're also looking for the ability to consider things critically, the ability to reflect on one's work. Without the test scores, every other piece of material in that application, every other piece of information is much more vivid. It's much more rich. If us not looking at the test would actually make it a more constructive experience where you're really thinking about your fit between yourself and the colleges that you're applying to, then all the better.